When we get to the creation text, to apply the same hermeneutic that we use in all these non that we biblical and the biblical illustration, are we trying to implicate anything to do with scientific explanations of cause and effect? And I say no. And the minute that we try to implicate and into the language of the text, some of these assumptions, we get into trouble. Instead, we need to implicate other assumptions about what's the supernatural realm like? Who are the gods or God? Who are these other supernatural beings who aren't gods? Are they really the sun and the moon and the stars, or are those just created objects? We fear the sea because it's this cosmic chaos monster, or, or is it under God's control? Can we rely on the, on the seasons? Or are we at the, at the mercy of these fickle gods that live in Mesopotamia who may or may not want to bring the change of the season that brings the rains that feeds our crops and gives water to our animals, or do we trust in Yahweh our God who has created all these things?